the air leakage target for the 2011 Explorer is much more stringent than for the previous model. Sealants are important for two reasons. They keep air out of the vehicle, which is important for NVH, which is a, a quiet ride for the customer. And secondly, they keep water out of the vehicle. And if water gets in, you can have from, all the way from a wet carpet to a corrosion issue down the road. Static seals go between two panels that don't move. You'll put down a bead of sealer and then weld the two parts together so that as they go through the paint oven, the seal expands and no water or air can get through the joint. Dynamic seals go between two parts that move, so they go between a door and the body of the vehicle. There's an upfront test that we do, which is known as the body and paint test, which is what you see behind me here. This is a test that we do to verify the sealers and the tapes and everything that goes on in the, in the body and paint shop. We fabricate the templates. We cut them from plexiglass and attach the uh, levers that you see on the body, and then we're able to clamp them down to the sheet metal. It's crucial that at this stage in the build for the Explorer that we hit our target. For example, if we don't hit our targets, it can cause issues with powertrain noise or with wind noise or with road noise. Our machine is capable of both pressure and vacuum. We will put it in pressure and we can listen to air leaks on the outside of the vehicle because the inside is pressured. And then we also go around on the inside and we put it in the vacuum. And then we can hear the air coming from the outside in, which is more so how the customer would experience it. First of all, we listen for, to make sure that our templates that we fabricated uh, are actually performing correctly. So we go around the vehicle first and uh, we listen to our templates. Once we establish the templates are working well, then we go around and we look for actual issues. Uh, issues that would potentially affect the customer down the road. And we document each issue that we find. Uh, we usually take a picture of it and we work that back with the appropriate team in order to get containment on that and permanent resolution so that we don't deal with this issue down the road.